Carving is this elusive feeling that you don't get in any other type of turn. It's this acceleration. It's the closest I've ever come to what it would feel like to fly. I love that skiing is a sport that is ever progressive. From when you're a little kid to you're 80 years old, you can still be a skier. It's not something that ends. It's not something that is ever stagnant, where I'm still becoming a better skier. I'm still creating better carves, and that's so exciting. There's so few sports that you can do by yourself and have so much fun. Granted, it's more fun to be with your friends, but I can go out and have a soul session where it's just me and my skis, and it's like my own little sanctuary. I also love skiing because you get to do it in the most beautiful places in the world. The mountains are my happy place. It's where I feel the most alive. It's where I laugh the hardest, where I feel the most myself. And they're just epically beautiful. There's this amazing insignificance that you feel when you're in the mountains because you're so small, yet you feel so connected to something larger than yourself. And there are not many places that you get to feel that. And because skiing is what I do more than anything else, I have that connection basically every day. I feel so lucky. But you have this freedom that I haven't been able to find anywhere else and it's addictive. Once you have that feeling of bending the skis at the top of the turn and then that crazy move forward at the bottom, it becomes part of your life. Like you look for it every time you go out skiing. <laughs>